and hi teachers and here's Edward and here is my uh, homework of MH uh, for you the unit five main unit the assignment and then I will give a uh, to uh, as a process to solve these questions the first question they give out the zero of the uh, negative five over two and the negative one um, one over two and three so zero can be also um, mentioned like uh, roots also the solutions means so uh they want us to give the equation about this uh sort of this family so the uh common equation is the f x equal to k and the x plus five over two and the x plus one then is the x minus uh, 7 over 2, and x minus 3. Here's a common equation, but uh, we need to write down the two more, so we can see here's a k, so we just uh, use uh, any real number to state the k, so uh, for example, we can just uh, use a 1, so it seems like the here, equal to x plus 5 over 2, x plus 1, x minus uh, 7 over 2, x minus 3. And we can also use the other real numbers like a 2 or a negative 2 is okay. So we just write down here and same as previous. So here's the first question. So answer. The second question, they give us the point of, let's see, the point of, the point is uh, negative 2 and 25. So we can use that point to solve this question. And same as this is y and this is x. So to instead of them, we can get 25 equal to k, negative 2 to instead of the, to instead of the x. So here's a, also, same as previous, sorry, negative 2 plus 1 and x, same over 2, x minus 3. And uh, we can use this point to solve this k. So, in here, we get the solution is uh, 25 equal to the k and negative 13.75 so here's a uh, we get the solution is uh, over k equal to negative 1.82 uh, uh, 1.82 so uh, the, the final equation is fx equal to one, negative 1.82 Sorry. And as same as I said previous. And for here's a final equation. But for the question three, uh, they need us to give a graph of the previous uh, A and B. So here is a uh, equation A and B. But the difference between them is uh, the question that uh, the a from is uh, we used this one as as the original answer to graph the equation. Uh, we can see here's the rules of the uh, here's the rules four rules equal to the previous four rules. Also, I said uh, the graph b, but the graph b we use the final equation of the uh, have the one point a two as as the previous. So the function that have the same rules, but the function b is a inverse function. It's inverse than the a. Uh, so here's a final solution of the question one. Here's a question two. So we just uh, move to the second one here. Uh, question two is is below to the uh. It's below is below to the the distance and kilometers and travel the plane. After the t hours can be the represents by here's a equation about that, but we should know the domain.
is between 10 and 0. And the question is, how long does the plane take to fly to uh, 4,088 km? So we just uh, put in here. And translate the 4,088 to here, to this side, the right side. Then we can put it into the calculator and get the final answers. So the first, the first answer we get is the uh, x, almost about negative ten point sixty eight. So uh, the second answer is x equal to about thirteen point sixty eight. Third answer is seven, but we need to. Uh, pay attention to the domain is equal to is between the 0 and 10 so we just uh, delete those two answers so the final answer is x equal to 7 so the final answer is 7 hours then we move to the uh, last question and uh, the last question is uh, about to to take an equation and the graph of the uh, to the decayed features, so we need to use those the those features to uh, make the equation and use a graph to make that. So we just uh, take this equation. So at first we can see uh, here is a x-intercept of the negative four. So the x-intercept should be negative four point ten uh point zero sorry and the y intercept is uh negative two so the minus y intercept is as we here <clears throat> as the asymptote we take the uh, x equal to two so here's a x x into two, two over there so and the uh horizontal asymptote is a y equal to two so here's a Why intercept? Yeah. Um, as for that, as for that, we should think about the uh, if the asymptote is in here, uh, so we need to uh, think about that the function should be inverse uh, probability function. Uh, the original function is uh, y equal to x uh, one over x is go like this. So it, it just moved to the asymptote to over to, from the zero to here. So we just uh, make a question about that. At uh, first, we can see uh, here is uh, uh, the x cannot be two. So the over is the, uh, the, the down uh, here, the downstairs is uh, x plus minus two and y equal to there. And the above is uh let's plus uh let's just put a a on there, and here's a uh, the oh sorry here's not a uh, two here's a one, I made a mistake, here's one here, and so the y is a uh, uh asymptote is one so we just put a plus one here, and uh for the Second one, we can see uh, if you just put the, the this point, so, sub this point to this function, so we, we can get 0 equal to negative 4 minus 2 over a, a above and plus 1, so plus 1, so we can get a equal to 6. So here's the final answer. So the final answer is the equation what sorry y equal to 
x minus 2, 6 both, and plus 1. Here's the final answer of the question, of this, this question. Okay, thank you. Thank you, teachers. Uh, thank you for our time. Here's uh, Edward Liu Yunzhou.